All also, right. I feel like I should do the intro though. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yes. But have we Go got a it. patron shout out though? Mm-hmm. Let me get it. Yes, quick. Balkan Anarchist. There we go. Oh, oh yes. We... Oh, we're we're already doing that. So sorry. These hey, names. patron shout out, Balkan <laughs> Anarchist. Thank you for supporting <laughs> us. Well, the best. We love you and your name. Um, <laughs> because of you, I've been able the, to the buy professional a, an arm for my microphone. Oh, <laughs> welcome. Yeah, oh. and it's got a little. When do you get I'm, the I hair think... plugs? <gasps> No, but I'm going for the MacBook, so mm. my hair's going to be a little mm. bit short for a couple of years until I pay that back. Listen, you look just like Demi Moore. You know when she did. Roger, <laughs> do you mean Roger Moore? <laughs> not GI Jane. I don't think we'll yeah, ever see not even not a not all. name. <laughs> Jesus. Is it too soon? <laughs> But again, thank you, Balkan Anarchist. We really do appreciate it. It does mean a lot to us. Thank you. Yeah, all the best. Warm wishes. Kind regards. Wait a minute, what am I saying? Welcome to the Horror Hour. We all go a little mad. We forget you. Don't start with Liam. <gasps> Did you see the Hellraiser book? Bruh. I can't. Uh, no, I have a bookmark <laughs> on Twitter. Oh it was God. like the 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 cube, and then it has the. <gasps> Could you imagine? Oh, um, that's that's camp. Thanks, Liam. And, and then it just when it opens up, it just like reaches into your guts and yanks it out and shit. Oh, I that's a kill right there. I have for the sequel. That would be a gag for the gay character. Just like a, it opens up, and they're like, <laughs> "Oh my god!" A and then it just yeah, yeah, yeah. That's hot. It's, Anyways, yeah. it's okay. Liam's <laughs> editing this episode. <laughs> Anyways, hello, everyone. Falls things on me. Uh, excuse me, we're trying to do an introduction, Liam. Keep calm and carry on. of unprofessionalism. I'd pick your lipstick. Anyways, um, the, the point is, for the, hello, everybody. It is I, one of your hosts, David, David, ZZAVID, whatever you want to call me. I don't care. It is I. Daddy. It, well, oh, Lord. It is I, yes, you're one of your fabulous hosts. And listen, I'm too excited to get into the uh, today's guest. So I'm just going to keep the intro for these three mm. very simple. <coughs> STD. Okay, so the person for this week, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> she's getting um, cocky now that she's off, now she's off the meds today. I'm kidding. Ooh. They got to find people that are willing to f- um to get in a CD. But um the point is for this week's I don't even want to think what I would have said on 20 milligrams, but the point is for <laughs> today's episode, we have a guest that I have become upset in the short period of time that I have known of her channel. I have been wa- binge watched all her videos, even the ones that I've never movies that I've never heard of or seen. I, but that's that's rare. That is rare. And to me, she's the princess of movie reactions. I don't have any authority on this, but to me, she is. Yeah. So <laughs> you can call her Lily, but today we're going to call her Aaliyah because she's fabulous. We're going to talk about her government name. Aaliyah, how are you, my darling? How are you feeling? I'm how are you doing? Great. I'm, so, I'm so excited to be here. Thank oh, you. I love you. I love because I, I, I don't know. I, it was the one that was recommended to me first was uh, Black Christmas. And anybody that knows me knows that. Any, I don't care. I, listen, it. it anybody could have been reacting to that movie and i'm just gonna be automatically gonna want to watch the reaction but it's when i was watching your video i was just like oh she's the one let me watch the next one and i'm oh, obsessed obsessed and and That's you're so new york it, it just you just remind me of my friends from high school and college and i was just like oh my god i feel so comfortable here and i was just like oh. anyways yeah i don't even really watch my videos i mean i just post it i'm like okay, you know what <laughs> <laughs> I love that. <laughs> I'm kind of the same way though, because I can't watch my face for too long. I'm just like, just post the shit. Like, I just, 
It's only it's only if like somebody comment, oh, this is my favorite part. This is so funny. I'm like, what did I say? And I have to go down. That's it. <laughs> I just love that you have a yeah. full on conversation with the audience. It's it's one of oh, my favorite things. Where she goes into the stories and just yes. like a tangent. That is my favorite. <laughs> I was just like, oh, this is fun. Yeah, love it. The chaos, just the ugh, the people outside. I just I just love. It. <laughs> oh my god. But anyways, for we we're so happy that you're here. I love you, and yeah, I'll tell you twenty more times Thank that I love you. you more. But for today's video, we're gonna be talking about a topic that I'm not gonna lie. It was easy and hard for me to pick people because I was like, I just know mm -hmm. that one of these is oh, gonna have at least two of these people. But it's we're gonna be doing Scream Kings. Okay. Now this is. At first, it sounds easy because you're just like, okay, so who's been? A, but if you think about it, when you think of your favorites, yeah. it can be a little bit tricky because men don't usually get the spotlight when it comes to horror movies. Because let's be real, the women dominate horror, in my opinion. But true. Correct. So this one was gonna be interesting to see who people pick because I was like, mm, I know some, I know for a fact somebody's pick because they're a whore. But I also am <laughs> <laughs> very curious to see how this goes. So I'm gonna start with the person who. Well, he's holding on by a string. He doesn't have that much time left. So let's go with Utica first. So let's let's see. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. I drop. I know. I dropped something. I'm sorry. No, it's the AI thing. Somebody's hacking into the horror. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. like the AI. Uh -huh. Yeah. 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 What ups? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Wow. Okay, wow. So I'm gonna choose one. Now we all know that sometimes the Friday the Thirteenth series, it gets just shit it on let's be serious but yeah, yeah, i <laughs> one of my favorite ones mm -hmm. is friday 13th part six jason lives and that star and the scream king in that is tommy jarvis all grown up oh yes 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 yes, yes, yes. Uh, he uh -oh. is fine <laughs> but he's also a fun like he obviously scream king because he lives but mm -hmm. he's very inept and he always has to have somebody save him. And I kind of love that. Yeah. The damsel in distress. He is the damsel in distress. <laughs> yeah. And he gets his friend killed. So he's an idiot and he deserves what he gets. But it's an actually fun movie and it takes it back to the camp. You get to see, you get to see. You oh, remember Freddy to the camp. Versus, uh -huh. I know. You remember in Freddy versus Jason, <laughs> Jason like bends the bed in half. Mm -hmm. Well, he does that to mm -hmm. somebody, but there's no bed. He just like. Yeah, I, I'm a whore for Freddy. Any Freddy ah. most Freddy movies, I'm usually a whore for. Yeah, even the ones where it's like the acting is bad. Was yeah. The one yeah. that Alanda, I think it was four or five that Alanda. Five. Had. It was bad. Was it? It's bad. It's oh, real bad. Oh no, guys! Oh no! Yeah, that's her acting. Yeah, that's her though. Yeah, <laughs> it was wonderful. It was a but... spot on impression. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, that's my that's my first pick. All right. Well, mm -hmm. another one. He has a lot of time, but it just doesn't look like it. George, um, what you got? <laughs> Thank you so much. Love, um, well, for, love you. Love you too. Well, actually, yeah, because I haven't seen you since properly since I watched um last week's episode. Well, the episode when we were recording so it was last it's week just it's just, with you it's just and Chu, and there's a few moments in there where my name. There's actually a five minute area where my name was just thrown about left right like it was a tennis ball in a court mm -hmm. yeah um to be fair actually you started bang, that bang, whole bang. thing off by saying that um, when we're talking about big gaping holes and then <laughs> he said oh george <laughs> but i appreciated the look i didn't through. say george's music career yeah give up you horrible horrible girl i'm sorry but i i i text jay after and i was like when jay said his song will go foil I was on the I was on the bus and I was like I laughed out loud. <laughs> I was like it was iconic. That but episode, oh my! Yeah. That was a it was a great time and um it gave me my official new nickname which is the Jill Roberts of the Roberts Horror of Hour, Hour which mm -hmm. I will absolutely take to the grave. So thank you so much for feeding my ego. So um speaking of iconic people, I'm gonna go with the one that people know that I'm gonna give because it's just uh... easier for me to get out of the way and. You can, darling, it's Kyle Galliner in anything that man has been in that's to do with horror. Let's talk Jennifer's body. Let's talk 
Nightmare on Elm Street. Let's talk Scream. Let's talk Let's not. Connecticut. <laughs> um, because I do think, you know, there's Smile. a lot of... Mm-hmm. Yes, Smile was amazing. Oh, Smile. Wow. I, thought you, I, thought you just, smile. I thought you just I thought you just went, Kyle. And I was like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I thought you were going to like reach out to him through the screen. But no, Ow. I think... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think that Kyle is an unofficial like king in the horror community because he has done so many great especially in those like the the mid to late like noughties and late tens and stuff he was doing so much great horror like every other year so i think it is to give him his due you know he might not survive all of the films that he's in but i think over horror and um in general in the more modern times he's definitely been a standout in general because Anyway, um, Scream King, that's it, doesn't have to be necessarily survive, it's just like they just, just you know, just have like, an impact. You want, they made you know, an he impact. has had such an impact on me. I wish he would have. Are you more. It, are you getting weak? Is that, I, is that like, what's happening? Are you getting flustered because all you're thinking about is actually his body, his yeah, dir- his dirty nuts on your chin? Uh huh. Mm-hmm. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. Yeah, so I'm just gonna. I have to say, Kyle, just get out of the way. He's, he's great. Oh, he's an icon. Oh, yes. Please. Oh, anyway. Yeah. So, um, him. Please, thank you so much. We love him. We want him. We need him. We crave him. Um, hashtag Kyle Galliner X George Alexander. Thank you. Okay. You out of your damn mind. Oh. No wonder he's so. I was going to say, if anything um, was going to turn uh, him gay, I don't think it would be you. Wow. Oh, you would want someone with like a bit more feminine, not feminine, someone that feminine, resembles feminine, Colin. Feminine, 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 feminine. Okay, sorry. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah, he was just like when I was younger, when that like those naughty films came out, he was just like my vibe as well. Like he was like in his machine scoff, gun like, Kelly. It's not machine gun Kelly. It's like. <laughs> It's my vibe is tall, skinny, dark hair, long, dark hair, like dark, like eyes that look like they've been like he hasn't slept in weeks. That's the vibe that I go oh, for. And Kyle so gave me that in Jennifer's Body and especially in Nightmare on Elm Street. But anyway, that's it. Thank you so much for your time. My TED talk well, there we is go. over. Thank God you weren't all that <laughs> firm and shit. Oh, okay. Anyway, to <laughs> on to the next. I mean, he's an angel. He's everything. He's, you know. No jokes, no jokes. He's everything. Uh, Liam, you got. He's eaten everything. Go on. Oh, I I was like, I was, I was waiting for him to be like. (laughs) No, I can be sweet. Um, We have guests in our uh, house. I can be sweet. (laughs) And I eat the sweets. I want her to come Um, back. So, (laughs) (laughs) so the first one I'm going to go away is. Somebody that was in something that I keep on trying to put pressure on. Um, oh, oh, oh! Uh, so I'm going with Elijah Wood. Oh, uh, to see if his roles in things of such You're like to put pressure the faculty. On? Oh, how? Yeah, that's towards you. <laughs> <laughs> I was not thinking you were going to say Elijah Wood, though. Okay, keep going. Well, ooh. Oh, there's that movie. Mm. Anyways, say your say what you're gonna say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Um, I'm always also think named because of Cooties. Yes, he which was is also a very good horror film. I do yeah. love that one. Um, and he's done obviously other things. Uh, I but he's I think he's mainly been the I like him in Cooties and other other horror things. So mm-hmm. these he's are the ones where he, there, I yeah. believe he's not a not a villain person mm-hmm. creep. Um. As David is aware, I have been pushing for the faculty. It has been it has been what a, a year now, David. No, 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 has no, it no, been no, a year? No. You've been pushing been on him like something's pushing on his prostate, sir. Oh, but it makes me want to pee. I've... Like if he hits it too hard. <laughs> oh. Listen, if he can watch Terrifier, he can watch oh. the faculty. You know. Oh yeah, you know, it's coming. It's coming. It's just like I gotta. I because got, next week's video is gonna be a gay one. So, because you know the BLT is, you know, it's not is their month and all that yeah, stuff. Yeah, so. yeah. Mm. I'm trying to, you know, I'm it trying is to, their month. So yeah. terrifier too. <laughs> Unless art is taking a, tw- I watch enough of Pride Month. I already <laughs> tortured myself enough <laughs> with the first one. Just uh uh-uh. oh, you know, I'm trying to, I'm trying to, you know, yeah, I'm trying to do the sanitize job. yourself. 
<laughs> I'm trying to do the Charlie, you know, what is his name? Charlie Puth and just, you know, banter to the gay community. Um, and all that stuff. Yeah. 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 Not like you're sitting there with a 12 inch. Bruh. Um, hey. Eight. <laughs> Oh, sorry, eight. Okay, relax. God forbid, God forbid, God forbid I should say the wrong size. <laughs> That's obviously a girth. Yeah, exactly, um, exactly. Mm. Oh. Yes, so Elijah Wood is an icon, a legend. Uh, Cooties, hilarious as a teacher. Hilarious interacting with the awful little creatures that are children. Um, even before they get turned into, obviously, evil little bayatras. Um Children are awful. Let's just remember that. Um, yeah. And then the faculty is, I love, it's so cute as a little nerd. I've got a thing for nerds. So I'm always just get watching them give. And George. Um, why and you George? That face? And what George? What oh, nobody's got a thing oh. for that. Oh. George isn't a nerd. He looks well, dead. Oh. Listen. Well, it's starting to resemble a bloated corpse. You're going up to show. Why are you shouting at me? So, anyways, yeah, Elijah right, bloated. Dick. <laughs> and come to daddy and is he... another great horror movie. It's oh, so that's good. A it's, good not, one. it's not straight up horror, but it's like very good. Yeah. That is messed up. Yeah, that's very a good fun. one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I keep I on meaning because you. Yeah. Use mm-hmm. what um we're talking about maniac. Oh yeah, he's the villain in that one. Where he's scalping people. Maniac yeah, you just kept on saying how good that was. It is a and good it, one. as I said, it was one of them ones where it was just on the list but never been watched. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. I am actually going to be watching that at some point. Ooh, this yay. week I've decided to make that this week's one of this week's movies. Oh, okay. Well, hey, you John Wayne Gacy. And I, I do do feel like watching um Cooties again. And then okay. obviously I can get ideas for when George passes his cooties along to everyone, or as it's more <laughs> commonly known, AIDS. Excuse me. We're we're curing well, people. Exactly, because you well, either have be or you haven't. <laughs> yeah. Um I hope well, your lungs. I love in. the final episode of the horror hour. Um, anyways. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Um. Okay. So on to me. I I want to keep this cute and simple because he stole my whole like heart. Aww. Well, I'll be his his pulse. You know the, the clap. Yeah, the clap is getting. Yeah. Anyway, the the one I pick is Anthony V. Perkins. He mm-hmm. is forever and yeah. Uh, listen, it was already good enough with Psycho in 1960. But then the bitch comes back in the eighties. Speak, speaking of AIDS. Um. Anyways. Mm. Uh, um. Sorry. <laughs> um. Oh, and he came back and delivered one of the best horror sequels ever made. True. And no. When I, I tell fact. you, it, it's such an amazing and the fa- I could watch one and two back to back and it would mm-hmm. just be like a beautiful continuation. They're both great in their own different ways, obviously. But oh my god, the way that Nor- Nor- Norman, but you know, the way Anthony Perkins plays Norman is just because he has, does that innocent boy next door thing so well, and he does the tortured soul. Like, it, it, and it, to me, is the ending that really solidified. If any of y'all seen, have y'all seen, I, have. Like I know the ending you're talking about, yeah. Liam. Liam, everybody's in the first one, Liam. You're in the horror out. <laughs> oh, sorry, by first one, I mean the remake. <gasps> die, die, die. You are lying. Not- no. I'm no. joking. I'm joking. Oh. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> oh my God. I think I had a heart attack. Yeah, that was <laughs> that was hard to swallow. Um, something George I don't know why said. you keep um, falling for this. This is about the fourth time. He said time it about I've three times years. now, yeah. And he's always. Well, it's, well it's, because it's I forget. For it. It's so I'm shocking. Medicated. Every yeah, time yeah. we hear it, we're mm. like. Yeah. Aliyah, have you seen Psycho one or two? <laughs> well, uh, listen, <laughs> I still love you, so that's okay. But you gotta add it to the list because it's so. Like, good. I feel like it's been spoiled for me like so many times. It's, it's so popular. 
It's fine. Yeah, just watch the remake. Watch, though. That well, the thing. remake is really good. Well, no, no, no. Wait a minute. The not the remake. The 1980, the part, Cycle 2, not the not the Vince. Yeah. Vince Cycle Vaughan 2 is Vaughan. so it's good. Because it fucks with you, and it's just the the way it starts with her, um, uh, 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 uh what's her name thing that she, you know, it, it starts off with Is it Meg Tilly? He's... Not Meg Tilly. Jennifer. Yeah, no. Well, Meg, Meg. Tilly is in it. But, yeah. But the, sis, but the, um, the sister of Marion. Yeah. She's, like, trying to, you know get him to not be released and all that stuff because that's like the whole thing and you know it's yeah 20 something yeah 20 something years exactly so 20 years so it's just plays out so well and it's like plays out like a you know because he feels like you feel like you're going crazy with him a little bit and then you see the end and you're like oh well yeah we're off the deep end of this bitch so it's a fun time it's so 80s and it's and it, you know yeah like i said mike silly anthony perkins ah, fabulous love it love it Oh, that oh, and the shovel. Oh, love it. <laughs> I love that scene so much. Anyways, great movie. And yeah, and for the young twinks, they mentioned it in, in Scream 6. So go ahead and watch it. You know, that's that because that's the they only do. way to watch a movie. Psycho is, if they is it underrated. Yeah, no, that's the only way to watch a movie is if Scream references it. Um, anyways, let's, uh, uh, Aaliyah, what you got for us, darling? What you, what you pick? Um, I was hoping that the worst. Um, horror movie boyfriends and husbands will win because I already <laughs> had that list ready. Because I I hate the whole trope where like the female character she you know she sees things she already knows what's going on and the husband's like calm down like nothing's happening we relax blah, blah, blah. so it. I thought of I thought of Sinister and I was oh. like oh yeah Ethan Hawke Ethan oh, Hawke yeah. Sinister Purge the Black yeah. So I thought yeah. I love Ooh. I love the ending of Sinister. Oh, I it's so it. twisted. He's an elevated horror. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love Sinister. I saw that in theaters, and that mm. was the worst first date I've ever had. And the last. Oh, oh well, yeah, because the guy I thought he was joking when he said he didn't like scary movies. And no, he just little... he just meant last. He just yeah. meant just uh, last. This <laughs> fool was sitting here like screaming and yelling like he died. Somebody, like <laughs> I don't know. Like George, somebody stuck George. You know, it, oh. I was just like, "What is? What, what are these noises?" I'm like, I was what? kind of embarrassed in this theater full of other people, and he is like squealing. I'm like, "It's not that bad," but I do love right. Sinister. But yeah, these for non horror people. Well, I thought he was joking. I didn't. I mean, and he even joked when he said, "I don't like horror." I'm like, "Okay, well, we're gonna go see a horror film." He's like, "Okay." I guess we both thought we were like, oh, okay. And then, no, well, lesson learned. Yeah. So, no, Let so you didn't f- him off or? No. Oh. So, why well, not? Could you? Could you it Especially if Ethan well, you can, like, on your screen. Well, like, you can Ethan. get a ride home. No, I'm kidding. No, I at least took him off. But no. Mm-mm. Ethan Hawke is a um, beautiful man. So, I would, he's just. I would like to see him in. I, I hope he continues to do horror because he's like gone through a stretch of doing it recently, but I feel like he might just stop. <laughs> or men.com. Yeah, that too. But mainly yeah. horror. Yeah. Isn't he going to be in a movie with um, <laughs> Pedro Pascal? Absolutely. All the homosexuals will uh, be seated. It, um, the BLT. Yeah, I don't know what it's isn't it called like mountains yeah. that move or something? strange way it's, of life. I'm not gonna lie, when I first saw the trailer, it, I th- thought it was a joke because it <laughs> played off so dramatic. Yeah, I, I do like, know what you mean. I was like, what the fuck is this real? <laughs> I thought it was like an SNL. I, I don't know. I'm sorry, that was just that was rude. <laughs> that an SNL. Just, it just it just not during Pride bit, Month, David. No, because it looked so over the top. Yeah, that it was like, oh, this Who's is a the joke. director, isn't it? Pedro, I can never say his last name. I'm not. Uh-huh. You can let us know tomorrow. Yeah, I'm all yeah, over. Uh, really, I can't. No, I can't. We don't care. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, his, a lot of his movies are like that, though. They're like over the top sometimes, or even camp. Like he's got one where like they're trying to. It's all these people's different lives, and it's focused on the three male flight attendants who are just trying to get through the flight. And it's just a lot of. It's so funny. I'll find it. It's really good. Okay. I love a flight attendant. Okay. I, love, yeah. I love an airplane movie. Well, um, wait, where was I? Utah. Oh, Utah. Oh, right, I forget. You know, I forget. <laughs> I know. 
Okay, so I picked a film I probably feel like none of you have seen, but you should, because mm. it's also got a really great cast. So it is, and you also know I love Josh Rubin. The teacher. Um, so it is 2021's Werewolves Within. Have any of you seen that? Of course. No. Oh, well. Almost that's... every weekend. It... I guess I it's very good. It it yeah. see thank you Liam it is actually very good and it's got our based on a video game uh huh and there are two scream kings in it uh-huh. Sam Richardson who plays the lead Finn Wheeler and of course our favorite lovable Harvey Julian he's in it as well <gasps> no oh yes. and so it's so much fun and basically it's this uh this guy who is a, a new sheriff in this snowy town. People have start dying, and then you find out it's clearly a werewolf, and it's about trying to figure out who's the werewolf. So there's kind of been a little bit of like mystery to it. Uh, I mean, limbs do fly. It is gory, and oh. yeah, it's really what good. What was it called? Oh Sorry, werewolves. Werewolves within. within. Oh. Also got Shea Jackson in it as well, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh. Oh. I think oh, I've, I've Harvey, seen the, the couple in that. Oh. <laughs> but it, it's really good and i mean yeah it's a good time it's it's a horror comedy so george you oh, probably yeah. don't like it's it funny. we know it's you don't funny. like horror comedies but it's funny it's good yeah. with the horror stuff as well and it's got the chick who's in the um i don't think you guys liam or george would know uh she's uh the at&t spokesperson like she always hello why would we know that wait no no no, not flow wait wait what was her name she like she stopped because people kept making fun of her big boobs. Kind of, do you know no. who I'm talking about? Oh. Yeah. What? Oh. Wait a minute. I I think what? she's back big to doing boobs. it, but like no, well, what? no, seriously, like she. <laughs> you, what the you boob? Couldn't tell if you watched the commercial, but then people found like saw a photo of her out of like all of this, and she's just you know, and people were like, <gasps> and so they of course like. Trash her DMs, where all this stuff, and she's like, "Doesn't have titties." Yeah, and she's like, "I just," she's like, "Okay," she's like, "Great," but I can act. And you know what this. America's like when it comes to the the human body. It yeah, can only I... be appreciated in privately by Republican men. Uh, well, well, they're usually sucking the bathroom, but right. some of them, I guess, I don't at the Roundup in Texas. Oh, my well, ex is living in Texas. Bring, you better get a Zush out here on I guess I'll find But yeah, so Werewolves <laughs> Within got several screen kings. <laughs> Check it out. Really good. Is it on okay. the, is it streaming? What? I don't know. But I'll an arrow. Okay. All right. So. Yes. Sorry. Because I watched it on streaming. Oh. Okay. I, I don't know what it's it streaming now. It, I have Sorry, I'm not it, bothered. So. I'm not but I own it. So, you oh. know, what else? On VHS. Yeah. Beta Max. I wish. Not Beta anyway, Max. You I'm go gonna... to hell. It's I'm on not ne- that old. It's on net it's on Netflix in the UK. Oh, oh. thank thank you. You're welcome. George, my yes. my prince, my sweetheart, my Someday, my prince will come. I'm right here. Um yeah, so I'm going to the I'm going Probably to Tucker's to Um <laughs> Euthanasia exists yeah. for a reason. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna go to the to the eighties for this one. Don't, and I'm gonna go Don't do this. I'm gonna well, no, I'm going with no, Bill. Good. Bill oh. in Society, the film Society 1989. You know, by the guy who did um you Reanimator. Not, you've seen Society? Yeah, because I liked Reanimator and it was by the same people, so I watched it. And Billy Warlock, who plays Bill in that. Oh, I was, Billy Warlock is. Oh, he was on Baywatch. He, he, he was in Halloween too. Anyway, um, let's stop talking about that film. He was like a little oh. character called like. Well, I, we just don't want to get me into it. Do it. Craig, his name was. Anyway, oh, he wasn't. Yes. Yeah, he, he was more of a standout than Jamie Lee was, obviously. But um, so but his character, Bill in Society, um, really good. I really enjoyed him in that. F- I'm just so baffled because Society is not a film I would expect George to watch. It's really good. No, I'm baffled because I'm tired. Ah. <laughs> but 
anyway, Society is a really good film. Basically, this guy starts to suspect that his um, rich family like a little bit weird, and he's like, "What's going on?" Only to discover that they are very weird. Um, not to maybe the the level that he maybe thought they were, but it's a really great film, and he's. He was just a stand up for me. And because he was, I know it's supposed to be like, oh, he was just so great in the role, the acting, but because he's like really good looking as well, it really did help propel. He's the only one who didn't have weird things happen to his body. Yeah. Mm. So, well, normally I go for that. So it was quite a shock for me when I went with some. You like when they have a head on their ass? He likes yeah. Yeah. Really f- <laughs> yeah. Bruh. At the same time. Oh my God. But that... anyway, Bill in society. Oh my I really... God. Yeah. <laughs> anyway yes so i would like to put forward that gentleman for my second pick um i really enjoy thank you society you're welcome it will go in it will go in the pot and we will pop make our decision at the end pop it in the book thank you put your keys in the jar <laughs> sorry i was watching the what braxton's watching? I, I was re-watching have you ever seen braxton's family values Mm-mm. Is that oh like God, the Adams that's... family? You are Adams family values. That's a film, isn't it? Yes, but uh, is the Braxton? Have you heard I'm of Tony Braxton? This is something with, like, oh, Tamar Tony, Braxton. Tony and... yeah, well, yeah, Tamar. Oh, Who's on yeah, RuPaul's yeah. Drag Race? Yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah. Well, it, they had a reality show, The Sisters, because it's Tony. Ah. T- yeah, yeah. So they had a, a reality Sorry. show, okay. and one of the sisters has. She was raised in. Oh, fuck! They were raised in. They were raised in the United States. They weren't raised in Canada. And one of the sisters is always like doing like the Canadian, like, oh, like a, 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 boot, a boot. Ho, like house. And one of the sisters is like, hose? <laughs> Mama, who raised her? Like, what the? <laughs> Anyways, that just reminded me. <laughs> I think one of the Braxton's anyway. was on Todrick Cole's song at one point. I mean, we don't talk about him anymore, but. Um, <laughs> I raised hey, her. From to... <laughs> Did they get a second series? Gail. I don't know. No, 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 no. Okay. no. Ain't nobody no. getting a second season no. out of that one. Um, anyway, <laughs> okay. yeah. Sorry, but yes, thank you very much. Uh, what's his name? Oh, Liam. Liam. Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. What's the ginger name? one. Yeah, there you go. Um. So next, I am going to go with. You don't have a list. I'm going to go with Patrick. I do. <laughs> But I was trying to decide between two because no one said him yet, and I'm expecting oh. you to get to have him. Oh, okay. Um, oh, I know. I'm going to go with he is Patrick not Rick Wilson. List, but I appreciate hearing his oh. name. Oh, who? I chose things okay. you wouldn't know. Patrick Wilson. Patrick Wilson. Ed Warren. Not... Conjuring. I am so sorry because I was looking at the old, the the other two, the other brothers. They've got, he's got brothers. Huh? Oh, Owen, Owen Wilson. And, Owen yeah. and, um... Are they related? Well, not not the Patrick. Yeah, Owen I was going to say Patrick's one. not related to Owen or. <laughs> I was uh, Owen and the other one, Luke. Luke, Luke. Luke. the hot Luke. one. Owen's the one with the crooked nose. I think they're yeah. both quite attractive. Yeah, I, mean, I, I would say they're both. both attractive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Elle's husband. Uh huh. Oh yes. Yeah. One each end. Bring him up, <laughs> friend. Then, but anyway, Patrick no, Wilson. <laughs> yeah, Patrick Wilson. Um, the only reason Patrick Wilson is on the list is the pants. Mm-hmm. The costume designer deserves a raise. Yeah, not the acting, just the just his pants. Yeah, okay, just, we'll just the pants. Yeah. But he's good yeah. in Insidious. Yeah, yeah who gives a shit about that? He's really good in Insidious. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. No, Patrick Wilson is on the list because he is in two iconic horror franchises. Yeah, that he's. Lee, yeah, with the rose, with yeah, he's carrying them. Um, obviously, Vera for Mega does a, an amazing yeah. job in the Conjurer, right, and down. Rose Byrne does oh, an amazing oh, oh, job oh, in. Oh, oh, oh. No, no, minute, I was what? I was saying, let's calm down because he was saying Patrick Wilson was leading it, and I was like, and he wasn't oh, yeah. mentioning Vera. Sorry, yeah, no, I wasn't me, saying about no. Vera. I mean, yeah, yeah I'm he's not hot that. and all that stuff, and he's yeah. gonna, but she's the one for me in that yeah. in those movies. Yeah, yeah. Oh and, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Um, Ten. and then obviously Rose Byrne in the Insidious fan- franchise. <gasps> Also, yes. I am. Right. I just love Rose Byrne in general. She's so um, good in Spy. In you know, Spy. the greatest, yeah, the greatest comedy film that's ever been on TV and film. Yes. You know, I think Pride has gone long enough. <laughs> <laughs> I <Listen>. think <laughs> one day you'll all see. Watching you see. One day you'll be <laughs> part of your world. 
Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Hey. Yes, this is an actual podcast. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, it's oh hard to believe. God, help us all. Yeah. Hey. It's hard to believe yes. that I'm Oh my god. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> you need help. Oh. Um, Anywho. So Patrick Wilson, he wears pants well. He mm. plays a good husband. Um he plays an adequate father. Um a good possessed husband. Oh yeah. Ooh, yeah. yeah a very on. good possessed husband. Yeah. 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 Um my favorite that's all he's done. My favorite it? is when he loses it at the end in part two. Yes. And he's that to me is peak. Like he just he was eating it up when he just was like following this bitch around. Oh, oh, I was living. Yeah. And he's got like then he's got the dark under eye. Yeah, like he's rotting, like he's just like that. Yeah. Oh, I love that. Yeah, that's the one. No, yeah. He, 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 yeah. And we get to see him put on his director hat this year. Why? Uh, Insidious 5. Insidious 5. Yeah, he's, he's directing, directing the new one. Directing mm-hmm. it. Has he ever directed anything else? No, this is a directorial debut. Yeah. Um, oh, dear. Um, that's just <laughs> right? That, that makes me a little nervous. Because <laughs> I've had mixed things, so we'll see. <laughs> Great gowns. Yeah, beautiful, beautiful gowns. gowns. <laughs> beautiful gowns. Great gowns. Beautiful. Like, beautiful. Um, so yes, so we shall see where he goes. Okay. So far, he has a screen pay. He could ruin it if he is a bad director. Because this is, is the which one? In the this is the fourth, fifth, 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 Oof. the final chapter. Mm-hmm. But is it though? Yeah. Well. Anyways, well, uh, on to mine. It, unfortunately, well, no, he had many more, a couple chapters, but this was a bit, one that closed <laughs> this chapter off. Mark Patton. Um. Anyways, and I there's no way that During I could make this list. as well. Listen, I had it, and also the fact that all minds are fags is t- telling of the month. But listen, <laughs> M- Mark Patton, <laughs> what he did. I know people for the longest time have shitted on this movie, and they can say whatever they want. But his performance was, it was so refreshing seeing a guy. Say like it's just so fun to see, and especially because he has such feminine qualities and a little bit of masculine qualities too. But it was just that perfect quintessential scream. scream queen. Or I had a big king. crush on him when I was a kid. When I first oh, watched didn't? that movie, I was like, oh my god, he's yeah. so cool. He's dancing and shaking his ass up in the room, and <laughs> so cute. And it, it, his performance was amazing, and I thought he was so. so I was, I thought that he was going to be more horror movies, honestly, because that scream alone, oh my god like there are women that can't hit the notes he hits when he screams like it is so good and just George the inter- the well I mean that's usually the, the no no the top are screaming when he yeah takes it I'm banging yeah. on the door yeah but anyways um the point of what I'm trying to make is that he was great and also the like the relationship between him and Freddie it was so oddly mm-hmm. homoerotic. Cool. Yeah. Because I remember when I was watching Scream Queens, there was a part that Freddie was supposed to stick one of his blades in his tongue, in his mouth, and like make kind of like do like a little erotic thing. And one of the people were like, walked up to Mark and was like, do not let him do that. Don't do that because it's going to fuck. Like, I mean, like the rest of the movie wasn't gay enough, but like right? that would have been <laughs> so good. Like just that little Ooh. moment of, oh, anyways. I thought his performance was great. He should have. He should be in more horror movies. He was in He's Swallowed. Everything. Swallowed was really good. He, but he was the he villain, was so I yeah. know we're not choosing that yeah, villain. Yeah, he was still good. He was. Yeah. And yeah, he was yeah, still yeah. just as camp. I oh, love yeah. That. Hamming I love it up. Mm-hmm. Like a, night, a lovely so just... ham club sandwich. Mm. Or any sandwich in that case. Like ham. Um, anyways, but the point is... Um, the point is great, phenomenal. Even if you hate it, just watch it. And it's he just gives the performance of a lifetime, in my opinion. Mm-hmm. He turned the oh, love him. We know, anyways. Yeah, mm, really? not a, amazing. No, I was and just it, gonna say, yeah, we're calling uh, you out on that one, Jay. I still can't. I'm like, there's so many fun moments. Like, granted, yes, there are things that I would have changed, but overall, it's such a fun movie. I don't know. I don't know, but um, you know. 
Partly because of the imagery are very Jay, familiar to me. Jay isn't um, just isn't ingrained in the leather daddy community like you no, are, well, David. And in, in her so... defense, in her defense, she, well, not in her defense because I don't defend this, but she's she loves the remake of Nightmare on Elm Street. So she's that's an icon. Why I'm like, that's enough. That's all I needed to hear. That, yeah, I forgot. That's about because that. she's real. She's a real bitch. <laughs> this is why she we love Jess. Yeah, she knows. She knows. She knows. Back. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> Ali, Aaliyah, darling, what you got? What you got? Um, this actor, he's one of those actors I hate for no reason. Like, I don't know if he did anything wrong in his life, but every character <laughs> he plays pisses me off. Oh, I think and I'm here saying about Justin Long. Just Long. <laughs> <laughs> when I saw him, I, I saw Barbarian. Barbarian. I, I was like, I was like, I know where she's going with this. <laughs> yeah, I could not yeah. Oh my god! And then I can't well, even watch um Tusk. I only watch it through your reaction. I can't watch that movie alone because you know. Even in my reaction, I showed too much. Like I was, this it's just a sick. It's sick. It's wet. It's slime. Ugh. Anyway, yeah, I know what you mean though. But he really is a scream queen. Like he probably yeah. is like arguably the. He's in what? He's got a couple like direct to video ones that have come out too. Like it's like yeah. he loves horror, which is yeah. great. But he always. Yeah. Plays either an idiot or an asshole, or yeah, yeah. Well, in this case, both. Well, he started off as an idiot, barbarian. as an idiot, and then he kind of like grew into the asshole role, didn't he? Yeah, I guess it makes sense. The older you get, yeah, yeah. But he really... well, obviously don't talk about his first one, but which? Mm. Where'd you get those papers? Um... Oh, I actually saw it for the first time a couple not so long ago. The first time. Yeah, it never caught my attention. I saw it with. I mean, it caught, I wanted to see it because it's like such a thing. Mm-hmm. But Nick showed it to me when I was in Chicago, and I was like, "Oh, this is actually pretty good." This is a good yeah, the, the first two were quite good, but no, then obviously best. you find out what what happened, and you're like, <laughs> "And also, Justin Long and Herbie fully loaded." Step back from that. <laughs> Not Herbie fully loaded. It was so good. What? <laughs> I'm Shut so up! You're so stupid. <laughs> Excuse me. You Herbie say what you want. But loaded. listen, Lindsay Lohan, Michael Keaton, Justin Long, well, anyway. George. Yeah. Herbie say fully it. bloated. <laughs> okay. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> sorry. Anywho, um. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh anyway. um, I'm preparing for my stand. I but... just found this out. Did anybody else know that Justin Long, when he was with Drew Barrymore, got kidnapped? Kidnapped? He got kidnapped by men when he was dating Drew Barrymore. I've seen a TikTok about it Hollywood? today. What was this? You saw a TikTok, and so that makes it true. What? Or did they have facts? No, like it was. It was like it was. It was like a. It was like a snippet from a documentary from TV. Talking about Justin Long being kidnapped because of his relationship with Drew Barrymore, and couldn't be bothered to search and find out what actually happened in the end. But apparently, he got member? he got spiked with he got spiked with PCP, <gasps> and then by some men, and then they like took him somewhere, and then the video ended. So I was like, oh well, I'll never know. Stay tuned for part two. Like I hate when they do that. <laughs> I'm like, just put the fucking thing at the same. I don't. Yeah, oh. and then you can't find well, it because it's like it's like a best. video from like two years ago. On exactly. The file, and you're like, yes, so far. I don't have time, yeah. so I just don't look for part two anymore. Yeah, no. that's just move wild. on with my life. Yeah. So yeah. there's no so uh, there's no role that you like Justin Long in that you've seen so far. Um, other than the chipmunk. Oh. Was he yeah. in Alvin and the Chipmunks? Yes. yes. In Alvin. Oh. Alvin. The more you know. I love that film. <laughs> Fair That's enough. About it, yeah. What's that Christmas song? Oh. Um, uh, oh. Um, they did so many great ones. Oh, anyways. Uh, oh. Yeah. I remember in Christmas. <laughs> yeah, but I love... Oh. That, there's a Christmas song that they have that I play every holiday season. It's so good. Oh my god, what's it called? Santa Baby? Christmas Don't No. <laughs> Anywho, After Hours. Yeah. Um, uh huh. <gasps> oh, oh, oh my god. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Little 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 boop. My bed. Little boop so... the nose. 
you. Who was out here moaning? Sorry. Oh, it's me. <laughs> sure. Good lord. I thought Shane Dawson was in for a moment. Um. Anyways, <laughs> I have a cat too. So. Oh <laughs> man. Never mind. Allegedly, allegedly. Um. Yeah. Anywho. <laughs> <gasps> Where are we? You talk as uh, you, know, you talk. You, you talk as well. Okay. So mm. I am gonna go. Ooh. Oh, this might steal one of David's. I've been trying real good not to, but this might. Well, I'll go ahead and steal it. I can steal my man, bitch. <laughs> ah! <laughs> okay. So he was a villain in one, but he was also a hero in the other, and that would be Chris Sarandon. Oh, no, okay. You're good, okay. You're good, you're good, you're good. So, yeah, yeah. obviously, the cop in um, Child's Play, but then the sexy ass vampire in Fright Night. Mm. Uh, ooh. He. Oh, things. What he I did... felt things. What that man did to me over the through the screen, no man has ever been able to do with his hands. I remember when he picked him up off that wall and he was just slowly dragging. When I tell you, nut everywhere. <laughs> From what we've yeah. from what we've heard, Utica's got the ability to do things like that. I don't Make know what not? you're talking about. Oh, well, definitely not that. Some shit. Oh well, yeah. Uh, well, you know. But yeah, I no. I should be able to lift a bitch. You'd be surprised. But um, yeah, no. I loved him in Child's Play, and I think it was a great film. He was really good. He was an inept cop for sure, gaslighting mm-hmm. everybody. Mm-hmm. Um, but Close then, to the mob. yep. And then he was just the most suave. Oh. Like, just remember the dance floor when he like ripped that dude's neck. Yes, that movie. Ah. <laughs> oh. that, that, nice. Just aesthetically, that entire movie is so good. Oh, like, just yeah, so, it's so eighties. Like, I just love the neon lights, the music, oh. and, uh, on and the Twitter. Clo- sidebar but on twitter somebody who was it that post somebody posted it and it was the the fright night poster you know the house with the <sighs> but oh of that poster but of different franchises like there was one for psycho there was one for evil dead and it was so cool i have a oh. it's such a cool idea it's just like the cabin and then the fate and then um the, the psycho house and then the mother of the school it was so cool like just well, i wonder who the um artist is okay yeah i have a bookmark so i'll send it to you yeah, yeah. Send the right bookmark, Good. please, because we know what else you've got bookmarked. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, just a, the yes, they do scat play on Twitter, but they usually have the advertise like you know the parental thing and all that stuff. So, yeah, one can only see so much of Nicocado Avocado. <laughs> no, Jeez. we've no. we have seen too much of Nick. I'd avocado. never even heard of the gentleman until no, I don't I think you've present. seen enough though. Yeah, we have. Oh, I don't think we've you definitely have. So seen I enough. Worry about <laughs> I feel like I've probably been inside of him. The amount no, of you haven't seen him topping. Oh my! You gotta see him oh, topping. No. Oh no! Uh-uh. That's the uh-uh. one. No. He has the he has the the t- the tubes to, to and the tank, and then he's like, I was gonna say, did he stop with the CPAP machine? <laughs> just stop. <laughs> I beg you. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, anyways, uh-huh. that's my I'll, pick. I'm so sorry for their behavior, Leo. Um. <laughs> anywho, uh, yes, yes, completely agree. Amazing. Who? Oh, George. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because I've I've got like five left, so I'm just trying to which one I want to pick. But I'm not gonna. Do, I'm just gonna do one more. Um. Okay, I'm gonna go with the, another obvious one, just because I'm what obvious and not like that Avril Lavigne song, complicated. So I'm gonna go with Evan Peters. Because I assumed you would. Thank you. Because in American Horror Story, he is fantastic um, in all aspects of it. And he doesn't get enough. And he was, I'm not talking about him in Dharma. I mean, he was great in Dharma, but I'm talking about him right. in his other characters. He does tend to play like the the bad guy, but I didn't know. I didn't get the memo about us not picking villains. So um, you were and- in the chat. Agreed. We didn't say we didn't say not villains. You just said somebody who we enjoyed said, their franchise. He said, "Can we can we say villains?" And I went, "Well, a scream queen isn't a villain. A scream king isn't a villain." I'm not going to listen to you. you agreed. Am I? So yeah, but I don't. And you I, agreed, yeah. Yeah, but it probably just because I was 
You were what? Smith, I was I was probably sniffing poppers at the time. So oh, anyway, geez. Evan Peters. <laughs> um, you could make an argument that he's been in other stuff, so can be. Yeah, yeah I mean, because Tony Todd to me is a scream king. Yeah, because oh. he was on he was on my list, but I was like, no, because he's just too damn good. He's just the ultimate horror king. Anyway, Evan Peters. Make me scream. Gr- oh. oh, sorry. What? Make me come alive. Come on and turn me on. Evan Peters. Um, touch yeah, me, you save just... my life. Oh my God, come on okay, and turn gotcha, me gotcha. on. Gotcha. Did it, did it to let me die young? I just want yeah, you to father my young. David Guetta you know, featuring Nicki Minaj. I just I want know. you to be my doctor. We're going to get a cracking chiropractor. Anyway. Um... My world is falling apart. My marriage is falling apart. My security is falling apart, and I'm miserable within my own mind and my body, and I don't know where I belong anymore. Everything's perfect. Okay. Yeah, so F- <laughs> that's going to be my wow. new single, guys. Um, oh, gosh. Evan, yeah, Evan Peters just absolutely George, brilliant. Super he, rap he has... star. Thank you so much. You know when, you um, know when on Drag Race Jay doesn't call Manila me George Minaj for nothing. Mm-hmm. Listen. Listen. I've had enough of this. I've had enough of this, you horrible, horrible girl. Um, Evan yeah, Peters is brilliant. He has or such an a adulterer. He, ha- I can't even get one man, Jesus, let alone two. But um, he he has such range throughout the American horror story genre that he's been in. I'll give you that. And yeah, so I really appreciate. It. My favorite one of his is actually well, I mean, Cult is obviously great because he's like in the shower but his, my favorite is him in hotel because sorry um <laughs> is him in hotel because i just think no i agree hotel is the one for me james patrick marsh like he was yeah. like when him and lady gaga that woman oh well, he was sawing her like cutting her up i was like oh this is the one for me that's just yeah, that scene no i did i did it yeah cause, cause, <laughs> that's yeah, one of the when bookmarks I'm out of, yeah because when i'm out of porn to watch i usually just think of that and i just not so yeah <laughs> But he, bless him, he deserves a rest. I saw a video of um after Ryan Murphy won for I think it was for um what do you call it Dharma, and he was yeah. like, you know, I think I might, you know, um give it give horror a break for a while. And bless him, Evan Peters' face gave a little smile because he was like, please, I've been through enough. So he's <laughs> the only one employing him, so he can't really complain. Is he what? About if, she, if she fucks with American oh, Horror yeah. Story. Oh, yeah. Do you watch American Horror Story, Lee? Oh, yeah. But I haven't seen all the seasons, though. Which one do you like? That you've seen, yeah. Um, it's coming. Season three? Season two? Season, no, three. Yeah. season three. Yeah. yeah. That's it's, great that, taste. My dad basically forced me to watch that season. Your dad? Yeah. Oh, oh your dad? <laughs> your dad is living, honey. She knows what's up. <laughs> That's the season for me. Yeah, yeah. He hated um American Horror Story story. Oh, oh everyone yeah. does. Most, most, people, the first, yeah. most people did. Yeah. 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 I, just, I, I just one didn't watch it. And I was like, mm. Yeah. Mm. It's it's not. Well, there's bad. some everyone episodes saying it was bad, so I was like, in season yeah, two, them. there are a couple episodes that I was like, I like so I like the Dollhouse one. Okay, yeah, one no, the dollhouse one was good. So because good. Yeah. I, the, the ending was a gag. So I, I did like that. Shook, there's another yeah. one. Fuck. There's oh. I'm trying to think. I didn't the ring doorbell one wasn't great. Where it was like seeing... there was one that I was like, oh, this is actually pretty oh well, I don't know. I, so I didn't like either way. It was not people, places, nouns. Yeah. So Evan Peters, he's done a lot, but mainly for his work in American Horror Story. And I think that I would like to see him do more mainstream, like movie horror, because I think he's definitely got the bag and I don't know why he's settling for TV. But because they're um, giving him 300 well, million. Okay, yeah, TV's well, worth that. Yeah. True, true. But I'd like to see him on the I'd like to see him on the big screen. I want to see him blown up on the big screen. Yeah, no. Be- oh, you well, mean he Evan tried Peters? and he failed. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No. Why, why were we see him? He's in like kick ass and stuff like that. Excuse me, kick ass didn't fail. Are you are you mad? Aaron Taylor. No, Johnson. he failed. He failed. He was trying to get in roles and stuff like that, and he wasn't getting that. Yeah, but he anyway. wasn't. He was. He so was, went back. He... So he went back to TV. Hmm. Well, he needs. To, I would like to see him, him in a. He she should do a rom com now. You just want to see him in a role yeah. that you could fuck him in. I did. 
All of the American Horror Story ones. Oh, that's true. Well, except except number one, because that's a bit... I don't like who he was in that. He's a mess. He's a, yeah. I mean, he's a mess in all of them, but I understand what you mean. He was good in Mayor of East Town. So good in I mean, in I Mayor felt so Town. disgusted. I felt so disgusted in myself that I wanted to just, like, suck the skin off the skin of cold. Oh, yeah, with the... I when, hated When he was in the shower and he was... I hated myself because I was like, this is sick. Ugh, I should not want to do You just know this. it was dirty and grimy. Yeah, and, yeah like the ew. cheese platter. Yeah. Yeah. Ew. Gross. <laughs> Listen, it's not my proudest some moment. class. Oh, it's not my proudest oh. moment. You don't love yourself. <laughs> yeah. I Thank mean, you. yeah, my mouth would have looked like Art's purse, but <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> I don't care. You keep my man's name out of your mouth. No. <laughs> oh. Okay. Thank Ooh. you very much. Mm-hmm. Liam. Is he still with us? So for my final oh. pick, mm-hmm. I am going to go with Thomas Jane in the mist. Oh, oh dad. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> That ending was brutal. Tall. It's brutal out here. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Oh my god! Someone well, mute him. Thirtieth um, of June. She's coming. You're not allowed to have volume until you can stop singing. Um, yeah, I might actually have to mute your ass. <laughs> <laughs> so, through, throughout the throughout the mist, Thomas Jane is is acceptable. Uh, I wouldn't say he was bringing anything new to the table. Mm-hmm. And I think Marsha Gay Harden kind of steals the show from him as the crazy church lady. She does. Most of the film. That's probably one um, of the most hated characters in horror. That's, at yeah. least easy and top five. She should be. Yeah. And but Have we done that, that ending alone. Mm-hmm. Most hated? I don't think so. No, because I think everyone's scared. Oh. Oh, well, most hated sure characters it doesn't mean you need to keep yeah. saying Jamie Lee Curtis it means characters that you watch on screen that a general public actually have uh, like disdain for like Marsha Gay Harden's in The Mist so before you could even go there George we'll just make sure you're not scheduled for that episode mm-hmm. you could put Jay there because Jay doesn't like um, Laurie either anymore Jay- Listen. She said in the she said in the live she said after watching one of the film she was like I can see George's point. She's coming to the. I don't know what the to... fuck is going on in this podcast, but I'm tired. <laughs> I... <laughs> Y'all play too much. Leave that. Leave <laughs> Academy Award winning actress Jamie Lee Curtis out of your fucking mouth. <laughs> yeah. Good Lord. Oh, she deserved that one. Anyway, yeah. go on. Oh. Yeah, so the ending of The Mist alone. Oh, I want to fight. That scene, I want to fight. I'm like... <laughs> the Dominican's coming out. Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh. Breathe. Mm-hmm. No, I'm good. good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm just good. go back. Just go back to the bukkake. Just, just go back. In your head. Yeah. <laughs> He's there. We're good. Okay. We can continue. <laughs> <laughs> the mist. It's fine. <laughs> um, fa- he likes John's it when it mists. But yeah. Um. Oh. Uh, he prefers more of a splatter. Um. I like it when they shoot ropes. So like. the ending of the mist is extremely good. It's extremely heartbreaking. Uh huh. And then obviously, he's just that clenching moment of. Oh shit! It's over, and it's literally just happened. Like literally, a minute, a minute more, everything would have been fine. And the music's was... so good. Yeah, it was a heartbreaking. Just this. Just... Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And he played stuff. it so well. <laughs> what he did? Mm-hmm. What happened? Ah, uh... the yeah. Yeah, someone help us. Uh, <laughs> this is when he's not medicated. <laughs> <laughs> There's no excuse this time. Just oatmeal. <laughs> yeah. Oatmeal and a 
gonna have semen. Oh, sorry, porridge. Um, thank you. Porridge. It's so simple. Does it have any golden <laughs> syrup in it? Just some peanut butter and bananas. Yeah. Oh. Peanut butter and your oatmeal. Interesting. Oh, man, that's, that's gonna be thick. Uh, so thick. So thick. <laughs> Oh my god. So anyways, yeah, miss. Yeah, okay, great. the miss great. Thanks, Liam. <laughs> Thanks, oh, Liam. Oh damn. Okay. <laughs> I've got buttons. I need to take oh. out the fridge here. <laughs> <laughs> well, um what? mine mine is really simple. Built buttons. Uh, mine is really simple. Is Vincent Price. He's just for me the king. I had mm-hmm. that, but I was like, uh, I know that. Yeah. No, he's my man. I and also a legend um but mm, yes, the point is alleged. he is he i feel like he was made for her just his face his voice just I that mean, mustache yeah oh yeah so the fact that he was friends with elvira it really right it really just it <gasps> clicks in my head and it just makes me want to just because he, he was a painter mm-hmm. he used to paint and he used yeah and he used to do a lot of stuff and he used to <laughs> did you want stuff. him to use you as the canvas he could paint all over these walls Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, Vincent and Price was a, he is like the horror daddy. Like Vincent I think, Price, I think he is. was so handsome. He was I, just like David is yeah. the reactor daddy. D- let's not do this. You want to flex, David? No, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> I'm wearing burkas and my like my my Evil Dead Rise reaction. I'm wearing a burka. Yeah. <laughs> oh, rah, rah, rah. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. But yeah, that to me was oh, like the fly, you know, like all these. He was, he's just been in so many horror movies that it's just like, there's no way you can't. Even if you've never seen a Vincent Price movie, I feel like when you, you know say Vincent voice. Price, you just, oh, you, you just know who think Price of horror, is. you know, mm-hmm. like you just think of yeah. horror and all those. So I just think he, for the children out there that are like, oh, who's Vincent Price? Do yourselves a favor and watch a Vincent Price movie and you can understand, even if you don't love the movie. Just his presence is enough to like kind of give you a chill a little bit. Oh, because it's so I think people need to know more about him. And the fact that most a lot of younger people don't know about him really like makes me house sad. on haunted hill. House on haunted hill. That's easy. You can find that shit on YouTube Marie. That's you such a good right one, now. too. Like I know yeah. I agree. I think Vincent Price is he's just an icon. He's yes, he's classic. He's legendary in, in horror. And Edward scissor hands. Mm. Yeah. For the for the younger people. Yeah. 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 I, I just Great. I love I love Vincent Price. No, I, I'm completely so that's an incredible so, pick. I still haven't gotten to this to his movies, but I remember reading that Doctor Strange's look was inspired by Vincent Price. Yes. So that was I, like, oh, oh, you could easily yeah, yeah. see that, yes. But it, it yeah, was so so that's pretty fun. Well, I can't wait to get Maybe to Maybe that's movies, why I was always it. attracted to the character in the comic books. Like, I, I used to um, collect mm. Doctor Strange comic books, but oh. I loved his look because he had that. He he literally... Was... If you... Oh, oh like, yeah, no, something about... yeah, yeah, yeah. They were all plastic wrapped, though. Keep them, keep them clean. Uh, I know that's meant to be a joke, but honestly, all comic books should be in that because they're worth a lot of money in mint condition. Okay. I mean, if I had them, I wouldn't be here. Um. Anyways. <laughs> Let's move on. Aaliyah, what you got for us? <laughs> Take us home, okay, please. I have, I have two people left on my list, but I think one of them is considered like a villain in the day all his movies, and that's Tim Curry. Because I watched Game Over mm. 2 last night, and I was like... <laughs> Oh, he's so good in yeah. Scary Baby too. <laughs> and then you got Clue. I would agree. I, Clue, yeah. and he, he was fucking scary. And what's that movie with the devil? Oh, the oh, devil. Legend. Legend. Legends. Legend. 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 He was that when he came out in that. I was like, that is mm, nasty. Mm, that, big ass movie did things to me. I mean, oh Lord Jesus! Oh God. Tim Curry's such a good pick. Ooh, take the wheel. Yeah. Well, I mean, you know, oh, Pennywise. I love Frank and, like, he is. Yeah, Pennywise, Frankenfurter, mm. Devil, all the yeah. The hotel manager in Home Alone too. Yeah, he was, <laughs> he was very scary. <laughs> he creeped me out in that in that one. I don't know. And when he did, when he just like the smut, the big face, like the Grinch face, when he yeah. just he's like, I was like, damn, mm-hmm. he's mm-hmm. great though. Yeah, he I'm was. glad he's going to more yeah. conventions and stuff now. He's feeling like a bit more. Bless him. A bit more and then I have um, 
What's his name? Um, Martin Henderson. He was in X and The Strangers oh, Play at Night. Oh, and the he ring. Annoying. Yeah, yes. he really is. Mm. Yeah, and he's looked good in all of them. Yes, mm-hmm. that man yeah. has not aged. Uh, maybe a little bit, but for the good. But he's aged oh, nicely. He's aged, yeah. but he's, he's aged, aged really nicely, well. like yeah, a good, yeah. cult. Mm. Mm. like a fine wine on a nice cheese. Dick cheese. Oof. Him in the, it's always dick cheese. Him in the ring where he's he's in the pouring rain and his hair's like. F- <sighs> okay, Mary, feel your fantasy. And he looks but, like yeah, he shoots. No, so. um, Martin Henderson is actually really good. Um, no, I agree. And his death in X is. Oh, oh, that's yeah, so good. Three times in theaters. Really? Did you? Yeah. Oh, are you working? Yeah. A, it wasn't. Yeah, I work in a movie theater, so I guess. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's iconic. <laughs> Oh well, you know, God. that's a, I have a question and like what's a movie that you've recently seen? Because I've got to ask them that you've seen like <gasps> multiple times in theaters. I gotta tell you a movie that I've seen like three times now, anyways. Ooh. But yeah, yeah. Aaliyah, what's like a yeah, movie Aaliyah, like you just you would not sneak into, but you're like, yeah, I'm gonna go see this. And when I first got my job, Pearl came out. So I slept in there a couple times. Yeah. Oh yeah. I love that. Yeah. I would have been there I don't too. know why. I went to go and see Pearl in a New York Manhattan um, cinema when it first I remember that. Was... Well done. Lincoln is it... Square, is it? On 60-something Street? 60, yeah, 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 the yeah, top. Yeah, yeah, It's right yeah. Up close to Apple the, Store. The chairs were like, like move. It was quite weird. My mum was yeah. like, it's my that mom is not, That was not my favorite. I like no, the ones on... because I thought it was where I was told to go, but apparently it wasn't. And no, my mom was people that are not from New York to go told to. you to go to that one. I'm, I think. No, Chris lives in New York. He told you Who? not to go to that one. Oh, friend, another Chris. group chat. Chris is like, don't go to that one. But I went to Typical that George. One. He didn't listen. And he went to that one. Because I like the oh, look from Steven, the photos no, of what Steven the confectionery replied first, area looked like. And Stephen said, yes, go to that one. And then Chris but then, corrected. But, I think but then Chris gone. corrected him after he'd already gone. Oh. And then I was like, yeah. Anyway, sorry, it was just a man because you said you're in New York. So. Anywho, well, I have seen no. Fast and Furious 10 three times. Because of Jason Momoa? I cannot. <laughs> I, at first I was like, oh yeah, he's so fine. Like, I love him. I just want to see him. By the second, by the time I got to the second viewing, I was just like, this bitch is eating up. Like, baby Jane ate this bitch up. And like, it, it was on some like unhinged. I was like, what did the director tell him like, what was the point yeah. of reference? Because I need to understand what... Because he was on a completely different movie. He reminded me of I'm Jack obsessed. Nicholson's Joker. That's who he, he reminded me of. Okay, movies. I get that, but I also get a feminine character. Like, I get a queen. Yeah. <laughs> I get a homosexual. Yeah. <laughs> he's he's went full. He's went full. I can't. He went full baby role. Jane. Like, like he's yeah. full on like yeah, yeah, yeah like all he needs to do is sing yeah like when we when in, we got out like, saying it I was the like, nail painting scene is... cracks me up every time so uh, every good. time and, and when he's like yeah we should turn on the masculinity a little bit around I was I was like you know what <laughs> so, I need you, I need him I need a longer scene with you. the one I'm the one that got me was um when John Cena gets and he just goes oh, well <laughs> uncle <laughs> uncle uh, you think he's not coming to the next barbecue. There was I saw a reaction to somebody doing that when Jason Momoa said we should tell them the masculinity around here. See, so he was like the guy was like, why would he say that? He's true. <laughs> I need like, to see this reaction. <laughs> I'll tell you I who it I is. I know who it is. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> wait. Right, wait. Wait. I think we should tell. Them. Okay. Never mind. Sorry. I'm trying to imitate his voice. Sorry. Oh. Uh, is I think it's the person who's blocked me. Anyway. Ooh. What well, the fuck are you we'll DMing move on. people? We'll, we'll move on. We'll, we'll move I'll on. I'll take it afterwards. After hours. After hours. After hours. Anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. But... George be pissing all the people off. I wonder <laughs> why. I could give a list. Um. Anyways. Where are we? It's the end. You said. Oh, it's the I, end. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but I, I am anyways, curious yeah. because I know since uh, <laughs> sometimes uh, our patrons vote and we're like, oh, we missed out on some good ones. So I am curious. You said you had a list of worst uh husbands partners i'm just curious who made your list my number one was the husband from the orphan <gasps> yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah yeah he was a dumbass recently for me was the watcher 
I was, oh, I was yeah. like that gaslighting. Ooh, I was like, yeah. I moved how far from West Bubble Fuck to be with you? You're over here, like telling me that I'm going crazy. No, you got me fucked up. I want to pack my bags right there. And then on top of that, like just also speaking a different language in front of her. Like yeah, that's fucking keep rude. it that that pissed me off. And she's like, yeah. What'd you say? Like, I was just like, that's ignorant. Yeah, like ooh, and ooh. she was learning too, but like he was just oh yeah, no, I would have shot him too at the end. Just got rid of him too. <laughs> like I, I like I, I did like when he took his shirt off though, because he had a nice body though. You can't deny that in the opening. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. He has, yeah, That's he's not, name. he's handsome and all that stuff. But I, mm. they were chiseled. Yeah, but yeah, no, he was, he was a gaslighting Annoying. bastard. Oh, he pissed me off. Anyways, awful bastard. Terrible, terrible. Well, I guess anybody else want to throw out a name, or are we done, or anybody want to take David? Oh, I guess it's throwing. Oh, he was just throwing out it. Oh my god. <laughs> um, but I am. <laughs> Just what's uh, um so Aaliyah, what's the next movies that you got uh lined up i just saw my reaction to um fear street <gasps> oh, i can't wait for the new ones to come oh, i'm sorry are these, i are can't wait to see soon? this reaction does anybody know anybody think about these movies uh, I, thought, I just know we just know who the director is and we're I think very it's excited next year. Damn. it's the director of watcher Shut the fuck up. Yep. Yep. It's Gloria Kuno. We were so happy. So it makes me very happy that you love that movie. But yeah, that's who's directing it. I was screaming. I was like, when that bag, that that bad bag, I was like, oh, apples? I was like, and then it took me a second. Anyways, but if you haven't seen Watcher, Ilya, it is, it's on Hulu, Shutter. It is phenomenal. Phenomenal. It goes slowly, but it's not a long movie. But it hits you, and then it just like, like right here. Just slow, it's like it's a really creepy slow burn because you have just you are just constantly on the edge. You're just like something must be happening somewhere. I'm just not getting. But it's a slow burn that's worth it. Really happening. Yeah, oh, no, it slow is. burns mm-hmm. that are like, oh yeah, so uh, the witch, and oh yeah, like you know, like yeah. <laughs> No, this yeah. was speak during the witch. <laughs> I think so. Yeah, <laughs> that's yeah. fair. A lot of people did. Yeah, let's not let's not bring mm. that up. Yeah. Anyway, I, I would definitely say Watcher because also it's stunning. It's beautiful. That apartment. Ugh. Ugh. I would. I, I. I would. I would live in that apartment. That was. Yeah. I'd have to watch it. Um, oh, you haven't seen it? <laughs> no. Oh, it's on Sky over here. Like, I feel, I feel like I've no, I feel no. like I've seen it because obviously, like Utaka and Liam were talking about it for ages, and like so, you would love I, it. I think you would like it. I mean, I love Chloe Akuna, so yeah, I will. I'll check. Yeah, it. That's yeah, true. Yeah, yeah, I think you you really would. Mm-hmm. Any other topics I want to bring up? So I, I no, I think list. I think it's a I think you had a great list. Finished. I've I the, had a great list for um for movie mothers. I yeah, feel like the then I we just this. have to have that'll you back and we have topic. to do yeah. that. We'll yeah. just like oh. that'll be the topic. Yeah. No voting. That'll be that that should be the next one. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mother of the house. Yeah, yeah. That should be the title for that one. Yeah. Mother of the house. Yeah, I'm, I'm of the horror house. Well, I'm yeah, of course. Ma. Yeah. I the agree. ultimate. John Crawford. Uh, oh, oh, the good one. Oh, that yeah. Mommy well, yeah. are. Mommy dearest. She had my favorite one. <laughs> she really did. Her and um Lala really turned the party for me. I, I know, slap, I slap, 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 slap. Yeah, I yeah. love it. Oh, but James was so it breaks my heart that she's gone. Anyways, I had a great time. Distraction. This was fun. <laughs> uh Aaliyah, I love you and I adore you. I can't wait for your next videos. I'm always Thank like you. refreshing, refreshing, refreshing. <laughs> but and you're invited back whenever you want to come back. And and where can the people find you? Yes, where can we find you? My YouTube is Lily TV. Mm-hmm. And then I always look at my Instagram. Hold on. Uh, um. Or your local somebody, New York movie theater. Somebody, mm-hmm. people can find my TikTok because somebody posted me on TikTok. They posted my barbarian vi- video on TikTok. <laughs> oh, and they were talking about this girl so real. <laughs> yes. <laughs> So good. But my um <laughs> my Instagram is Aaliyah dot n o r r e. Perfect. I'll make sure you're linked everywhere and all that stuff. So mm-hmm. you know, yeah. I need I when, when I found you, I was like I need people to know about her because she's hilarious. She's everything. Thank you. Love you. Love you. Well, 
to the people that are still listening and watching and whatever they're doing directly listening to us thank you so much for joining yet on another amazing spectacular episode of the horror hour and so next week if you know if y'all want to see more and all that stuff then you know i mean i don't know why you want to see more of these people but if you want to see more of me then you know you can just follow me on my youtube channel and yes yeah, so i had a blast and guys i love you all <laughs> And if you want to see more of all of us, you can follow us on our Patreon where we have early access <laughs> to everything. And at the Horror Hour TV on Twitter and Instagram. Thank you so much. Like I would be such there. a mean drunk. Like, I yeah, just know I would be so think <laughs> Drink below. Yeah. That's why I had to stop drinking. Anyways, but the point is, everyone, <laughs> have a beautiful day. <laughs> Bye. 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 You have been listening to the Horror Hour. See you next time.